how's it going everyone? WTF Sexy Headphones here. Happy Tuesdays or Wednesdays to you guys. So this is, I even feel like late to the news, but I've seen some of you mention that you still haven't seen it. You have not. Yeah, I'm so sorry you have not seen it. Like literally right as I went on vacation, this is what popped up like the moment I left. Stalker 2, official trailer motherfuckers official stalker 2 trailer say it with me it feels like the dream is finally coming alive oh look katia my chernobyl puppy how very suiting for you to pop in at this very moment <laughs> it feels like it's finally real like we've been debating and kind of uneasy ever since it has been announced that Stalker 2 is back in development because they've developed it before and then they stopped and it has been an always a touch and go with whether Stalker 2 would actually be fully realized, whether it will legitimately come out or not. And even, and especially now, like in these uncertain times, as literally everyone says, how many times have we fucking heard that phrase? In these uncertain times, we're just like, well, shit, like... Could this be what causes... Like, we're waiting for anything to bring this down the hole again. You know what I mean? Because it's come and it's gone again, and we got our hearts ripped out, and it's been so many years. And now it finally feels like there's no going back. There is an official trailer for Stalker 2. An official stage, the, 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 the official trailer for Stalker 2 that was announced, like, I think four... I want to say maybe four days ago. I'm not... That's around when I went on vacation. Ha! It feels... Katya, what are you doing? <laughs> I can't even... There's there's no words. Like, it's... Again, we've all just been concerned that it's going to somehow die, fail, whatever. It's going to get canceled again. Something's going to come up. And it's not... It's like they got the trailer out. Xbox is the one that kind of announced it. It was under their their showing um, because it's going to be. Yeah. So for, for those of you who don't know, because someone actually mentioned literally in Discord like a half an hour ago that they didn't even realize there's a trailer. So I'll just I'll just talk about it like some of you might not know. It is going to be exclusive to Xbox and PC or console exclusive to Xbox and then also on PC, um, which makes it seem that they might put it on PlayStation later, but who cares? I don't think any of us are worried about that. Pretty sure any of you guys on my channel most likely have a PC. Most of you are stalker players, which means that you have a PC. So that's really the main drive here. Some people have scattered thoughts about it being on Xbox. I, mm, for the most part, I'm happy for it because whatever helps them make more revenue, um, at the end of the day, they're a business. They need to make money. That potentially could mean more stalker games in the future. So the wider audience that they have, I'm more all for. Because if they could make stalker take off more to where we get more stalker games, that would be fantastic. That would be absolutely amazing if there's a bigger demand for it. So I really hope that stalker gets more attention now. Now, naturally, I'm kind of like you guys too, where I'm a little bit, um apprehensive about it just because uh i've seen some people in the comments of the the video um i guess thinking that this is coming from metro they're like oh like this is trying to imitate the metro series or there is another one that people thought that this was like stemming from so so obviously the people who don't know it kind of kind of pains us a little bit because we're just like ooh, like that's you have no idea what you're talking about you are hurting our community stalker is og so there's gonna be some of that and we will all find it annoying and we will all find it frustrating but ultimately i'm looking on the positives of this if it could be spread out further hopefully it gets more attention that could mean stalker games in the future i um, is kind of what my mentality is. So let me know what you guys think about that, about it being on console. Do you see the same way? Would you rather it just be PC exclusive to us since it's always been? Let me know what you think. Ultimately, I think it will be hopefully a good thing and be able to branch it out a little more. Uh, but I'm not, uh, you know, we'll, we'll have to see as far as that goes. So let's talk about the trailer atmosphere oh my god so much 
Atmosphere. This is why we love Stalker. At least I presume most of you are very much on the same wavelength as me. Is there's just no atmosphere like it. Like you don't get this shit in Fallout. Um, other fucking games that I can't really even fucking think of right now. But other post-apocalyptic post games, particularly the American-styled ones, are all. I don't know. I don't even know how to describe them. I played most of Fallout 3, and I was really fucking bored and rushing through it. It's just, the way they feel sucks. They're very gimmicky and kind of silly. You don't really get a good survival sense from them in my eyes. Um, and, and, you, and the atmosphere just kind of sucks. Like, Stalker is all about atmosphere. That is what I've loved. Like, when I first started playing Stalker, I'm like, the feel you get from the noises, the images everything it just comes together in like this beautiful mixture and the trailer just like like the music in there it's so it's so pretty it's so beautiful like that ominous music that dark almost chill feeling oh my god it's so beautiful i love it i love it oh my god i can't wait you get to see so the rookie camp is in there for those of you who've not got to see it yet cordon uh cordon rookie camp is in there um, which is awesome because I don't know about you guys, but like the rookie camp is like you're, you're obviously, well, I mean, I don't know how you feel about it, but obviously the rookie camp is your entry, your entry experience into it. And I will always have a love for the rookie camp. It's one of my favorite spots in the whole entire series whatsoever. It's one of my favorite spots. I love the rookie camp. I have like much love for it. So rookie camp is in there. They show these awesome anomalies that are interacting a little bit more with the environment. Now this is not gameplay footage. This is all cinematic. Um, so that leaves the next kind of question of, okay, but we want to see gameplay. A lot of people are like, yeah, cool. Where's the gameplay? I love what we have as is just because of what that means and what it looks like. And it looks great. And I'm wondering too, like, will there be cinematics in the game? Like stalker was not a cinematic style game when they had, um, I don't think you can call it a cinematic, but when they had a, a cutscene, so to speak, it was just literally the gameplay characters. It looked no different than anything else. It was just literally kind of zooming out on the scene that you're on. I mean, they did, they did, I guess, have cinematics like in the opening and the beginning. But besides that, like there's no gameplay cinematics throughout the game, really. Um, so is this going to have a little bit more cinematic feel to it? Are they going to have some more of that perhaps in the, in, in the gameplay kind of, I guess kind of how, how Metro has like some of theirs in between. Um, eh, they kind of do. Yeah. Eh, I guess there's some more in the beginning too. Now, now that I'm trying to like literally think of it, they don't really have really many cinematics besides beginning and beginning and kind of ending as well. So, hmm. Maybe not actually. Sorry, I'm trying. Like, my thoughts are all firing, and I'm just speaking as I, as all these things come to my mind. So, um, then when I have to try and slow myself down, I'm just getting kind of, <laughs> ah, I'm like, wait a second. So, so will they have more, uh, kind of like, like, I guess, like a classic cinematic kind of feel to, um, will they not? I'm not sure as far as that goes. Obviously, none of us are. Um, but at least what we've seen as far as that trailer goes, it's so gorgeous. You see, um, like now how that's going to interact again with the gameplay is the question. So again, you see, there's this one part where you see an anomaly and it's crushing the cars around it, um, with just like its force. And will that be like a thing? Like obviously the, the anomalies in the original games, like interact, like if a dog or, or anything walks into it, it kind of rips it up. You see leaves moving around, but, uh, as we know, anomalies can spawn in different places. If there's like, say like a truck in that area is going to interact with that. That'd be actually really super fucking cool. Um, if that's kind of how they do it. And then you get to see some labs. It's Saint Stalker without some fucking labs. <sighs> yeah, obviously link down below for those of you guys who have not seen the trailer yet. So I'm gushing about and going on. Link down below if you need to find it and you have not got to see it. Um, that way you can understand what I'm gushing about. But oh man, the music, the visuals, <sighs> anomalies, artifacts, rookie camp, labs. Like all the shit that you want in, in Stalker, you know what I mean? There, there's a small part we see a bit of mutants running through. Um, it's it's all, all your key points. So so let me know what your guys' ideas are. Let me know what your thoughts are. What do you think about the console experience? Um, are you super excited as I am? There's some people who are just kind of like, 
Yeah, but where's the gameplay? Like, they seem unsatisfied because they don't have gameplay footage. Obviously, we do want to see gameplay footage, but I'm pretty fucking happy with what I've seen. I'm pretty damn, <laughs> I'm pretty damn ex stoked, and, uh, uh, I lost my train of thought again. I'm just, yeah. I had a thing in my mind that I was going to say, and now it's gone. I can't focus. I'm fucking excited, so... I love what we got to see. To me, that seals the deal that it's like, okay, like I feel like we're at a point of no return. Because again, all of us have been in this uncertainty of, yeah, but like it totally could just stop again. Like, you know, it has before, it might again. But I'm like, oh, there's no turning back, man. There's no turning back. It's announced for Xbox, it's announced for PC. Like, we're in it to win it, baby. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm so excited. But let me let me know what your guys' thoughts are on the trailer, on the console thing. Um like what like is there anything that you're hoping for? Um I'm kind of hoping for like while obviously we all love classic stalker, I'm kind of hoping that we might see like a new mutant or two. Um I think it would just be neat to see like something new. Like I've seen concept, uh, concept art of different types of mutants. I think that would be cool to see. But at the same time, it's like we've had three games in the stalker realm that if it's all within the same kind of time period, I guess it wouldn't really make sense to have something new if we have not seen it before. Um, so I kind of have that in my mind. But at the same time, I'm like, I've seen like some concept art before. I'm like, man, that would be fucking cool to see. Like that'd be really neat to see a little something new there. Um, to, to give it to give it something different. So that would be neat. I'm also kind of hoping to see new areas, new maps. Obviously, we have, again, it shows like the Rookie Village and it's showing other areas of Pripyat and so on um, that are the classics, of course. Um, but it would be neat to if they made sure that there's kind of areas that we have not got to explore in the zone in there. So I'm kind of hoping for some new areas as well mixed in with the classics. I think that would be pretty sweet as well or a different air or even if it's a different area of the areas we've been in, you know, something something obviously to to give it a different feel. Because, again, while we do love Stalker and it's been around for a while, I mean, all of us, I think, would agree for the most part. We want things to be very similar. We want it to follow a certain way. Um, but at the same time, you know, it's a new game, so I want new experiences. I'm assuming most of you guys would want something to kind of freshen it up and give it new. So it's not like it doesn't feel like you're playing like, you know, the same thing. Like, obviously, we want it to have the same core values, the same feel, but we want some new additives on there. You know what I'm saying? Like, I want... That's all I could really as put it as. That's... Again, I cannot formulate my thoughts very well. I'm just... <laughs> <laughs> I'm so stoked. This trailer is so fucking beautiful. So again, it is down below, you guys. Make sure to watch it. Hash out. I want lots of comments, friends. Make sure to hash out everything you think, everything you feel. I want to know what you guys are thinking, whether it's positive or negative. I want to know what your guys' thoughts are on all of it. Let me know. Let's have a great stalker chat. Uh, my Discord's down below as well. If you guys want to chat in there, feel free to join the Discord. Yeah, I just... Mm. Now we play the waiting game. But hopefully if they put out a trailer, we're getting close to that time. They always announced that they were not going to do much advertisement or give us much of anything of Stalker until until it was much, much closer. Because again, like we had like a three-year time span to wait. And they were mentioning that within less than a year's time is when they'll start giving us content. So hopefully we are now in that point where we will get to see new things. Because so far we have bread, <laughs> which was a leak and they didn't want to show us anyway. So we have unexpected bread. <laughs> and then, of course, now we actually have this trailer. So here's hoping we'll start seeing more uh, in the near future. <sighs> I can't wait. Let me know what you guys all think in the comments below. <laughs> Bye. Feel my power.